Hi, this project is a demonstration of online diagnostic lab reporting system. This system is an online di diagnostic lab manager application that brings up various diagnoses working online. User can see variety of tests conducted by the lab along with their cost. The system allows user to book any test as needed. After successful booking, system calculates total cost and allows user to pay online. The system allows admin to attach a copy of the report into the system and automatically email it to the intended patient. Let's see how the system works. There are two people who will log into the system. One will be the admin and the one will be the patient. Let's see the admin module. Admin will log into the system using his ID and password. Let's enter the ID and password. Once the admin logins to the system, these are the various options he can access through. Let's see the add test details. The ID will be automatically generated by the system. He must specify the test type and cost. Let's enter the test type and the cost. Once he clicks the submit button, this detail will be stored in the database. Let's see add parameter details. He must specify the ID. Admin must specify the name and the minimum and the maximum value for the particular test. Let's enter the parameter name. Minimum and maximum value. So once you click the submit button, these details will be stored in the database. Let's see view patient appointment details. You can see the patient patient appointment details by specifying the patient ID which are listed over here. Let's see the patient test details. Here the admin will specify the test details of the particular patient by clicking on to the uh, patient ID which are uh, listed over here. So once you click the patient ID, the test ID will be automatically generated by the system. He must specify the test type. So once he clicks the test type, he will get the cost of particular test. This will be displayed by the system itself and he must specify the uh, test name. And he must specify the present value of particular patient. Once you click on to the submit button, these details will be stored in the database and will be displayed to the particular patient. Let's see the report module. Here, the report will be generated by the system. Admin must specify the test ID and he will get particulars about the patient and he must specify the test type. Once you select the test type, he will get the report will be in their tableau format and you can send mail about this report to the particular patient or you can print particular report by clicking on to the print button so let's click on to the send mail button so particular report is sent to particular mail id is successfully sent so let's click on to the print button to view the report This is the report generated by the system. This is how the admin module works. Let's see the patient module. If the patient is a new member, he will register himself by clicking on the sign in button. The ID is automatically generated by the system. We will specify the following details and this details will be stored in the database and we will use the ID and the password in order to log into the system. I had already registered myself, so I will use my ID and the password. So once the patient logins to the system, these are the various modules you can access through. So let's see the appointment module. So he can uh, book the appointment uh, by selecting the date and all. So this appointment number is automatically generated by the system. He can view various test details. So he will select the test, particular test and he will specify the date on which date he is uh, about to take the test. And these are the time slots 
which are displayed by the system you will select the time slot let's select uh, this two and once the patient clicks on to the book button he must uh, specify the credit credit card number cbv number total amount will be automatically generated by the system so let's enter the credit card number if he enters only five digit so system will display an error message so you must specify 16 digit of credit card number and you must specify the CV number it should be three digit and you must specify the value date the total amount will be automatically generated by the system once the patient clicks on to the submit button user error message will be displayed you can select only one time time slot so only one time slot particular user must select so once he clicks on to the submit button his appointment details will be booked and it will be reported to the particular admin if user clicks the same date you can see that this slot is all, already booked by particular user so you can select other let's see the view appointment details particular patient can view appointment details by specifying the appointment number so you can see view the test details as well as the date and the time let's see the view report particular patient can view his report by specifying the test id as well as the type of uh, test so this is the report Gener generated by the admin so you can view that so once he clicks on to the print button this will be downloaded this report will be downloaded this is how online diagnostic lab reporting system works thank you